This is the Snooper S7000 Truckmate Pro and what we're going to show you is what happens when you first switch on the device and how to set up your uh, vehicle dimensions. So when you first turn on the S7000 Truckmate, this is the menu you're uh, greeted with. You've got navigation, you have the built-in television, the media player and the, the phone set up for the Bluetooth. So if we click navigation, the first thing it's going to ask you to do is tell the unit whether you're in a car or the truck. So you can see here, just a quick simple checkbox. Uh, the car mode just allows you to use the S7000 as a normal uh, in-car road navigator. Uh, the truck mode obviously takes into account your vehicle dimensions so it avoids any narrow lanes, low bridges, weight restrictions, anything like that. So if we click I agree, this then loads up and you can see there's a couple of weight restrictions on the uh, on the display there already. Um, now there's a new version of the S7000 just come out called the S7000 Pro. You'll know this is the Pro because you have the, the grey uh, graphic across the bottom of the screen. The old versions carry the black uh, display. So if yours has a black display, get that updated right away through Snooper. Um, now when you're looking at the main mapping screen you'll see you've got the current speed limit here, your speed, the direction of travel, the name of the road that you're on and then the two indicators on the right here both GPS and the, the battery status. Worth noting that we're actually indoors at the moment but we have full GPS signal so that just shows that Snooper are using the latest and best in GPS technology. So if we turn our attention to configuring the device, press the screen anywhere and it brings up the main menu. This is a navigation menu but we want to go across to configure and this allows us to change all the settings on the device and most importantly if you click the truck icon you'll see here this is the menu with which you upload all your uh, vehicle dimensions so you can enter the height, the weight, the width, the length, weight per axle, truck type, even load type so if you're carrying hazardous chemicals uh, the device will route you away from places you're not allowed to go uh, next to reservoirs and such like. So that's the setup. Once that's stored that stays in the memory of the device and you can store up to 10 different truck profiles. So if you, you drive one of a few vehicles and you don't want to go through the rigmarole of inputting data every time you get into the car then uh, this will solve that for you. Equally if you run a fleet of vehicles and you just want to program in each vehicle by number plates you, you can do that as well and just give those to the driver as they set out. Okay, so if we come back out, once that's saved, like I say, all you're going to want to do is search by city, by postcode, um, you can set up multi-routing on there as well, but that's to come in a later video. Any questions, feel free to call us on 0800 321 3617, and if you'd like to look at buying the S7000, please look at all our offers online at www.satnavwarehouse.com.